Hi guys, this is my favorite Boko Pie and I gonna leave the description for the ingredients of this. It's very simple and this is one of my favorite. What you have to do is to mix all together the flour and the two cans of coconut milk and a cube of butter that is already milk and mix mix all together it's very important that you mix all together and it needs to mix together all of this um all of these ingredients so mix the flour and the two cans of coconut milk and this is the simple of makapuno pie ingredients you see two cans of coconut milk that is very important flour optional for cassava grated shredded cheese one one uh, can of condensed milk, three drops of vanilla, cube butter, and mix all together. Mix, mix all together. And when the texture is good, you can add your condensed milk. Mix, mix all together, guys. Any kind of condensed milk brands is good. And um, I use I use with this kind of um, this condensed milk. It's um, it's easier to find in our store <laughs> mix all together again if you pour that one just leave for a little bit of the condensed milk and mix mix all together mix mix all together with a shredded cheese and three drops of vanilla Um, you can also add a little bit of yeast if you want, but no yeast for for me. I just only for um, yeast is only for um, only for a teaspoon for yeast, and then leave it to set so that it will raise your flour. But without yeast, you can. Um, yeah, make like this and just only for flour and coconut, pecans, coconut milk, no water. Mix all together with uh, with that coconut milk and the makapuno string and string and and the butter. When it's all mixed together, then that is that is good and when it look like this means to say that is good not watery and now we're gonna prepare for the oven to warm up and then set it for one or oh, 170 for to to warm up and then you can set it to 230 and then put the, the little of the condensed milk that is left in your in your uh, condensed milk can and if you, if you have a little bit of uh, string meat coconut um, meat you can also put in uh, as a topping 
uh, also with the coconut uh, don't mix anymore just leave like this you can clean up in the side if you like I just leave like this because I can I can shake a little bit of the ball just shake a little bit of the ball so don't forget this to put in your coconut uh, in your uh, mixture with the coconut milk and the flour and mix mix all together it's very important mix mix all together with the shredded cheese And then now that it's prepared, put it in the oven. That's already set for 2.30 in just um, um, only 35 minutes. 35 minutes to 40 minutes. And just watch if it's uh, already golden brown. And when it's golden brown then you will see that it look like this and voila that is already cooked you see that uh, my uh, yeah my companion here at home they love also with this and it look like this guys when it's already cooked but the half it's already gone because they eat already they leave me with these four pieces for me but just only for one slice or two uh, it's good to go with um, fresh brew coffee or tea or hot chocolate uh, milk or um, coffee and my coffee is always with uh, milk uh, i know some who is strictly with coffee no milk but for me i love there is milk with my coffee so that's it and enjoy your creamy delicious macapono pie and until here guys and i hope that you have a beautiful day and don't forget to subscribe and see you next time once again thank you for watching bye bye